worthless, I am a failure, I am nothing. These are not things that you would plan on telling yourself, and if anyone would ask you if you had said them before, the answer would probably be no. Still, against all of your best intentions, you can still catch yourself saying it. In high school, everything seemed effortless. I had begun shooting competition archery, and honestly, the future felt like it was so far away that I had thought about it, but I just didn't even think about where it would actually lead me. I could shoot when I wanted to, and I had the people in my corner to help me when I needed the help. I was basically on cloud nine because I could go to a competition and not do well, but it wouldn't bother me because at the end of the day, I had fun and I just learned from my mistakes and I would move on. If I made a mistake, it really wasn't going to affect my life in general or my future. I love the idea of starting and stopping a competition. I had people around me to help build me up. So if I did bad one day, they'd say, well, it's okay, you can do go and do better. But if I had a really awesome day, they were there to help me, support me, and wish me good luck. But what happens when all of that disappears? Who are you left with? Who are you? When college came around, I was tasked with the idea to find a degree to base my whole life upon. And all the decisions that I make in college were important and they mattered. And the rest of my life would be based upon those decisions that I made in college. So suddenly everything that I did mattered, especially in archery, because no longer was my individual score the one that mattered. My individual score affected the team scores. Now everything that I did, it had to matter. My equipment, and my tuning and my form and keeping up with all of that was all solely based upon me and how I did and how I performed and how I fixed it. And all of those responsibilities piled up on top of me and suddenly I started losing my confidence. My score started deteriorating, my shot didn't feel like it once did. I started looking around at the team around me and I was wondering what they thought of me. All the pressures that I had put on myself led me to feel like I was a failure. I never told myself that I was a failure, but once you start thinking in your head that you're not worth it, that you're not good enough, those thoughts, they become a toxin in your life. In the midst of this, I stumbled across a picture of my showcase with all my trophies inside of it. Suddenly, memories started filling back in my head. Memories from my national championships, memories from standing on podiums, memories of successes that I've forgotten, because I had all convinced myself that I was a failure. But once they filled back in my head, that's when there was a change.
was hoping for someone to come back and hand me the confidence I lacked, as if going to other people and asking them how my shot was doing was going to change the fact that I didn't have any confidence in myself. What I found out was that I needed to find the confidence within me to shoot better because when everything else was taken away, when all the people that helped me, when all the people around me, when my team, when everything else to external was taken away, that I was left and I was the person that I wanted to be with my confidence. So through all this, I found out that you should not be constantly thinking about what other people are going to say or what other people are going to think about you because that's just a road to failure. There's always going to be someone that's going to look at you and they're probably going to think something negative because there's always at least one person out there that's going to be jealous, but that does not need to stop you from your success. What you need to think about is your confidence and how you're going to do well in a competition because you're the one who practiced for it. Even if you don't have something to look back upon like a case of trophies. Every successful person has started off somewhere at zero at some point. So take that into consideration. Look look at the person that you look up to and that you want to be like and then drive your confidence from yourself and from that that you can be just like that because they had to start somewhere as well. You can't get anywhere in life by doubting yourself or doubting your skills. Everyone is different and everyone else, everyone has something to give to the world. So grab your confidence and get out there.